Tonight's contest is between two top six sides. Bentley are second, and they are chasing another top-of-the-table finish. They have bolstered their squad with mid-season transfer window, adding Nick Ward and Dimitri Hatsimaratis. Captain Jack Wedsu is suspended for tonight's game after receiving a red card last weekend versus the Melbourne Knights, a game that needed a last-minute winner from Kieran Dover for Bentley to take all three points away from Summer Street. Hume are currently six, but a win tonight could see Ufuk Kubalehan's side end the round as high as fifth, but a loss could see the Hume drift down to eighth. Last weekend, Hume played out a nil-nil draw against Pasco Vale. Tonight, they'll be buoyed by the return of their captain, Nick Haggerty, who missed last weekend's games. As Hume kick off, Blair Govan hurried into clearing it long. It's into midfield. Holmes laid a ball off, and Hume will be able to hold on to the ball. It's Dylan Jacoupi who plays it up the channel looking for Prasad. The ball falls into midfield. James McGarry picks the ball up, and James McGarry is forced to go back. Young Hayden Tennant in a bit of pressure. He's forced to go back as well. And Hume now get a foul in the centre of the midfield as Bentley really pressed on him really hard and McGarry's fouled. And the Studiatus is shouting his players to switch it because there's space on the right-hand side. They're still trapped in the left. Ball into midfield. He's now cut out by McGarry. Liam Ball and he's getting some early touches in this game. And running forward is Hegarty and tries to play the ball through. Attila Offley's through. Can he get in and score? He goes around the keeper. Can he finish? It's deflected up in the air and Ryan Scott will collect to Clark. And they try to build as Clark lays the ball off to Prasad. McGarry as Hume's attack is shut down for the moment. Urson Kaya makes his way up forward as Hegarty now tries to play the ball through. It should be cut out. It is. It's up in the air by Yankovic and headed forward by McGarry. Jumping over the top there was Prasad. The ball falls in the midfield. Bentley should be able to hold on to it. But they don't. Attila Offley wins the ball back. He can get a shot away. Offley. And it's just over the top. And there was no touch there from Ryan Scott, but powerful effort there by Offley, who seems to be in the moon so far. Well, his last delivery was just a little bit too low, and it was cut out easily by the Hume defence, as Jankovic and Archibald now make their way forward into the box, and that's where the ball goes, near the penalty spot. Up goes Thurtell. The ball rebounds at the edge of the box. That who can get it away. It's still bobbling around, poked around, and Michael Weir makes the save. And they go back to Scott. As there's four Humes players close to Scott. So Scott will play it over the top. Brennan, wonderful flick header. Here's Glavin. Glavin's got space on the right wing. Glavin's one-on-one with Blair Govan. Now he lays it back to Brennan. Brennan whips the ball in near post. And sliding in there, not being able to get there, was Hatsi Maradis and Michael Weir collects for Hume. It was an unorganised start from Hume. And... Very fortunate not to find themselves behind us. The long ball is going to find Brennan, who goes first time. And it's going to be Michael Weir to collect. And it's half time here at Kingston Heath Soccer Complex, where it is Bentley Greens nil, Hume City nil. Plenty of action, plenty of shots in the game so far. As we look to join you for the second half. And we're underway here, the second half, as you make that half time change. Passard off. Theo Markellis gets 45 minutes under his belt here tonight to see what he can do. And it's Bentley with the ball here. And they pick the ball up now. Brennan over the top looking for Thurtow who chests it at the edge of the box. It's dangerous here. Thurtow turns and the shot is wide. Boland is offside. But Clark is not offside. Can he get there first? A foul has been given. He can't believe it. Archibald, he thinks he's won the ball there. Clark goes over. Surely it's going to be the left foot of Nick Hegarty, you think, to take this one. In fact, he steps away and McGarry plays it in and he goes and it's over the bar. He had a shot. Plenty of numbers in the box. He looked for the top corner. Hume with Attila Offley. Who's got space on the right wing. Attila Offley runs forward. He runs at Pilkington. Hatsi Maradis comes to help him out. So he's got both players at the edge of the box. Tennant comes to help out. Ball into the box. It's cut out. It's up in the air. Tennant versus Litvin. Litvin chests the ball back. Tennant slides in. The ball gets deflected out. Clark will get the ball back for Hume and McGarry. In the centre of the pitch. Trying to find Theo. He does now. Theo can't turn out of trouble. And the ball gets forced back. And it will be Dylan Jacoupi to give it back to Theo Markellis. Dylan Jacoupi makes a run forward. And here's a chance. Offley out of his feet. Offley. Attila Offley. It's just wide. What a wonderful save by Scott. And as the ball gets now whipped in there from the greens. Near post. Michael Weir will collect. 
And with Michael Weir throws it out early for Theo Markalis. Attila Offley is in pace. Can the ball get to Attila? He's quicker than Litvin. Litvin makes the foul. He fouls him out wide as Attila was looking to try to get to the box. As the referee sets up the wall as Litvin is standing right in front of it as the ball is trying to be set up. So they're going to have a two-man wall. So you think that Hegarty this time will try probably chip the ball in for Hume. It's Hegarty chips the ball in and the header's on and it's in the back of the net. Liam Bowen flicks the ball in the back of the head. And Hume City have got the lead here. Wonderful header from Bowen, wonderful delivery. And it's been a solid 15 minutes here from Hume City. have been on the attack. And Scott had no chance. A whizzed ball in across by Nick Hegarty near the penalty spot. And Liam Bowen again buries it for Hume City. Michael Weir now with the ball for Hume. So Hume have made two substitutions. Theo Markellis has been excellent since coming on at halftime. Ball over the top. It's going to be headed back. It's going to be Hegarty to pick the ball off and lay it to Clark. Clark at the edge of the box. Can he get inside? Gets a shot away. Not enough power on it. And Scott picks the ball up. Now and he sprays the ball out looking for Brennan. What a wonderful ball that is. First touch takes it away. Whips it into the box. Cuts the ball back and the shot's in. It's just wide. Now across the centre circle, back to Theo Markellis, out to Clark. Good ball. Clark is with Glavin, looking for support, so he holds on to it and lays it back to Theo Markellis in midfield. Theo across to McGarry, and now they're spreading, and McGarry can get it out of his feet. McGarry from range, shoots, and it's wonderfully saved again by Scott. He tips it just past of his post. It all opened up as Bentley plays were forced out on that right-hand side. It opened up in the midfield. And now here's Bentley, who will try to counter, but they've got plenty of numbers back, Hume. And Panetta's quite happy to hold on to Honos. And Nick Panetta will, is quite happy to take the card as Bruno drops the yellow, but now picks it up and gives it to Panetta. Just a definite professional foul there. So now we wait for this Ruffin free kick in the middle of the park who clips the ball into the box, comes out Weir. Solid punch, gets it away. Glavin will now whip the ball back into the box. Free head of Yankovic, and it's going to be 1-1. All on his own was Yankovic, and he powers it past Michael Weir, and Bentley Green's at back level in the 86th minute. He's not allowed to have it as he's well defended by Tennant. Now that's a wonderful ball to the right wing. The ball into the box. It's cut out by Jakupi. Edge of the box. Here's Honos. Out of your feet. Honos goes and turns away from players. Can he get the shot away with the left foot? Honos. And Michael Weir goes down to his left and makes the save. Blair Govan has his free kick deep in there. Defensive half. He plays the ball on to the left wing for Clark. And Clark heads the ball on for Theo. And it's going to be Scott to collect. The referee looks at his watch. Scott, is there one more chance for Bentley as Scott plays the ball long, looking for third towel? There's not. And it's full time here at Kingston Heath on Friday night, PlayStation 4 MPL action. It is Bentley Greens 1, Hume City 1, goals from Liam Boland and an equaliser from Marco Jankovic, both headers in this game. And that's the way it ends as John Anastasiadis and Ufuk Kubalehan shake hands here at the halfway line. Plenty of attack.